Okay, we are live at the courthouse. You can see everyone's got their signs out. Okay, we are live at the courthouse. Thank you. Yep, you're welcome. Nice. All right. I'll get that other one. Thank, Thank you. you. All right, so we're live at the uh, courthouse in South Venice. This is open till what? Six thirty. Yeah, till six thirty to get down here. This is the last day for early voting. Um, the, you do have representatives from the Democratic and the Republican Party here. You do have Mike Rand's table, but he's not here. Um, signs everywhere. It's easy to get lost in a sea of signs. So we're going to see if we can do some, a little bit of exit polling and see what's going on. I didn't see too many. I saw one red shirt, and that's a Trump thing where you wear a red shirt out. So let's see what we can get. I'm on Wi-Fi here, so I can stream for as long as I want. We'll, we'll give you guys a little scan of it. There's Trump. And the Democratic table is behind them there. I think the signs are in the way. Let's see. You don't know where it's at. Basically, you go down 41, uh, just before Walmart or the Jack Aranda Road, right where the FHP is, you turn right in there. Nobody's coming out from voting yet. It's down there. You gotta keep, I don't know if I can show you guys the distance marker. Let me see. Let's move this out here. So, right there's the distance marker. You're not allowed to go beyond that point uh, with your political stuff. And also with the camera. Hello. Two more young ladies going to vote. Hey. Oh, they stopped by the Republican table. Is that an indicator? All right, so. If anybody comes out, we're gonna, we'll try to see if they want to talk to us live and see if they want to say if they voted for. We're going to get two things. Uh, did you vote for Trump or Hillary? And did, if you're a city resident, did you vote for me? Okay. <laughs> oh, they stopped by the Democratic table, too. Maybe they're last... They're undecided. Love the sign there. Do not feed or molest. Can't molest the gators. They cannot be tamed. And feeding them may result in a hand for a handout. Mistaking a hand for a handout. <laughs> That's probably one of the funnier gator signs I've ever seen. I think I got you guys in there. All right. Let's get back to the polling here and see. Okay, they're hanging out at the Democratic Party. Mike Shalasco, he's a fan of the page. Hello, good morning, good. No exit, nobody's exited yet. I've seen about 30 people walk in, so. I know that sample bell is long. Whoops. Ugh. Yeah, there's two, there's two 
Okay, I think I just missed two exit pollers. But what I did get, and I'll look at this, this is the Republican Party's choice for uh, judges, which we haven't seen out there. So pretty interesting. We'll see what we get from there. The exit polling is going slow. Frank Abrazino's most boring production. <laughs> I would interview the Republican and Democrat Party, but I already did that when on the first day of early voting. After this uh, very interesting production that I'm putting out, <laughs> we're going to cruise on over to the art festival. Let's see if I can get that lake. Nope. I'm really I'm surprised at how long it's taken to exit unless they're using a back door. By me. They're saying we don't want to go by that Frank Everson with his video crew. We're going to try moving this because I think there is. So let's move it over here. There, I thought I saw some people sneaking out this way. All right, all right, we just moved it because I think they're coming out that way from the back door. I was wondering, I saw a ton of people coming in. I'm like, where are all these people leaving from? Hello. I did, by the way. <laughs> You did? Yeah. Thank you. I got my first vote. <laughs> it's a beautiful day. 
Let me see if I can give you guys a breakdown of who I'm voting for looking at these signs. Maybe I'll add some interest to it. I, I'm voting for Mike. He's a Democrat. And although I'm an, indep I'm an independent and everybody knows I have far right views, I'm going to surprise some of you guys with my vote. So I'll actually stand here with some of my votes. It's all about repositioning. Let me finish off that. So, I'm, Fred's a Democrat from Sarasota. So, I'm thinking about going his direction right now. The other surprise is, I'm thinking, I'm not thinking about going with Julio. On my radio show, I've interviewed him. I've interviewed him on my other shows. But the issue is, I haven't seen him out and about in public's eye. And I don't know why. And I've seen Manny out. And even though he's a Democrat, he's got a lot of uh, great ideas. He's against fracking, which I like. He's against uh, teaching to the standardized test, which I like. He's against uh, privatizing Sarasota Memorial. So a lot of good things with him. Uh, we'll see. There's a split. We'll see if we can get an exit. We might have to carry this thing around. We might have to go over to that door to do our exit polling. So let's see. Let's pick up and go over here. See if we can get some exit polling done. Alright. We're gonna move over here because I've noticed they live in out there and I was wondering where did all these people go? So we'll try to get some exit polling here. Let's actually go in the street a little bit. One of my legs is broken here. I gotta see which one. Uh, this one, okay. That way we're not interfering with the sidewalk. Um, the other person I like too is Bender, and I like Jim Bender for this reason. He is, uh, he only ran basically for the same reasons I did. He didn't want Barbara Ford Coates to run unopposed, and he's a firm believer in uh, term limits. I don't think he's got a chance, but he's a very nice guy, but I like what he stands for. Hi. Did you vote? Yes. You want to tell me if you went Trump or Hillary? No. No. Okay. <laughs> no, I don't either. Hey, cat. How are you? Good. Good. You going in to vote? No, he is first time. First time voter, huh? I let's let's get him mind. live on the shot. First time voter. <laughs> I don't want to sway your opinion, so I'll ask you when you come out who you voted for if you want to tell me. None of the above. <laughs> None of the above. Remember, there was a movie about that. Yeah. Right? Yeah. So. I was going to tell everybody. Okay, just write my name in for president or something. I don't know, can you be on two different parts of the ballot, you know? I don't know, I was going to try it. I don't know. <laughs> I'm sure that they would, I'm sure that they would tell you. I, I do this thing called the scoop, yeah. You want to do a quick oh, exit vote? Oh, Venice scoop? No. No? Just, you don't want to no. tell me who you voted for? No, not really. Oh. <laughs> oh, you, do, I mean, do you live in the city? Three guesses who I voted for. <laughs> Sick of Clinton. Oh, okay, we got a deplorable, cool. <laughs> Well, you know what? They were all going in here, and I was waiting for them to come out, and then I found out they were coming out this way. You go in there and come out here. Yeah, oh. yeah. So I had to move around. All right. Yeah. Uh, Bella is not first time. Yet, yeah, right? Bella's first time. Yeah. She's uh, we like yeah. going on the actual day. Yeah. Oh really? Yeah. I didn't know what it was going to be like, and I know he's got doctor's appointments. So Mine. Where I go, it's, it's always it's quick where I go. Excuse me. You're not taking. You're not putting pictures on Facebook, are you? No, I'm doing a live video feed right now. Of people? Yeah, you're allowed to. I asked. I talked to the uh, voting office. <coughs> okay, I don't want my. People. No, <laughs> I'm le I'm legally within my bounds. Who said that? Huh? Who said that? Yeah, uh, the tax collector. Uh, not the tax collector. Yeah. Sarasota sort of votes. Uh, what's the election thing? Office. Yeah, you even got the email. If you guys want to challenge it, you can call the cop. I'll go ahead. I'll give for the email and everything. I mean, that's just not the not the rules they told us. Mom, I'm just telling you, I got an email. Well, and I think because you heard me talking about Trump, and you're at, over at the Democratic table. Well, see, that's Is this the problem. Where they come out? You're, you're, you're actually okay. just not supposed to be here. Dude, I tell you what, call the police, and I'll show them the email from the voting office saying I can. As long as I'm 100 feet from that door. Yeah, no, I get it. No, All right, no. then leave me alone. 
Well, actually, that's not the, that's not the rule, actually. That uh, is. No, yeah, don't, don't put that thing on. Can you, is this guy a nut job? Can you stop bugging? I'm not a nut job. You're just not allowed to mention it. Look, just, just because, from, look, you cannot silence people. somebody because they're not for your candidate. Okay. Your strong arming techniques will not work with people. All right? Look at them. Another Democrat. Democrats need to go. <laughs> huh? You can't. I, I forget the lady's name that's our uh, voting person. She wrote me personally. Uh, no, I got it. I saved the email because I knew jerk like that guy would start something. There was this one lady, I think she was for like the hospital board or something. Well, I had to take her into the ocean. I'm going to laugh when I email hey, Officer, here's my email. Don't delete it. I got it actually right on here. I wonder if I could pull it as I'm shooting live. Well, I don't like how it They want to come up and try to strong arm you and tell you you can't do it. He'll call some police and we'll show the police that. According to Deborah Dent, supervisor of elections, I can film 100 feet. You know who it is? I found the email, Deborah Dent. I asked her, can I film live shots? She said, 100 feet away from you, you can where the point is. Yeah, you're not, you're not asking, you're not trying to sway what? people. I, I know, all I'm asking is, you know what it is? I was watching some stuff, and the Democratic parties get pissed because if you're exiting, you get a bunch of points of calling. Because the idea is to see where most of the people are voting. If there's any fraudulent activity, so you go out and you ask it. No, the Democrats have been trying to get people arrested and harassing them. No. Well, especially when he's going to go over there and harass you because he won't want does it because you're now poor pro of his party. It's a sea of science. Look at all the science. You're going to get lost in the sea of science. Who the hell cares? I see Mike Moran sign. I don't know who, who the hell knows what he stands for. I'm trying <laughs> to find out information on any of the hospital people or the artery. You bore me. Can you hard to find anything. Uh, I, I actually, uh, I don't know if you watched it, but I filmed where they, uh, it's all the candidates in the hospital review board came in and they all covered what they're for and that's like the first time I've ever seen anything like that from Bill Yeah, I, I didn't see it, so I, you know, I don't know. Yeah. But, you know, I just figured on two things and I could have so I was scared that Hey, did you see what your the Democratic Party just tried? Is that? You see what the, the Democrats just tried? They got pissed because I'm exit polling. They what? They got pissed because I'm exit polling over here. Oh, yeah? And I'm like, you're just pissed because you're done with the Democratic Party, and I told you I supported Trump. And he's like, I'm calling. I'm like, oh, please. I got a letter, email from Dent saying I can be 100 feet away. I'm filming. Yeah. I don't, I, just, I don't understand why they get so upset over exit polling. <laughs> Because they Unless it's they, rigged, because, because <laughs> they aren't doing good, and they it's have they have fear. gotten they have gotten nastier and nastier and nastier. This whole this whole they were friendly at first, and then they just kind of started drifting the other way. And all they were talking. That's true. The guy was kind of a jerk, wasn't he? Kind of confrontation about. Yeah, and it's going live. He yeah. kept trying to get out of my shot. I was turning it towards him. Yeah. <laughs> I just say, yeah, I go, do you, do you mind telling me who you voted for? No, okay. <laughs> yeah. And I wait until they come out. I don't pressure them. Yeah. <laughs> hey. I've, I've had people even contest where we're, where we're at. You know, it must be 100 feet away. And I said, hey, the county puts up that sign there. We should, we're this side of the sign. We're okay. I'm never going to complain about it.
until the idiot came over. <laughs> They're they voting? Yeah. It helps, it, you know what, someone came on and doesn't like it. I, I think it helps a lot of people so they can get down and vote. So I'm fine yeah, with it. Yeah. throw stuff out like, oh, Hillary did this, or Trump did this, and it's like, well, where's some facts on it? A lot of times they do that at the last minute, just to sway them. They did that with, uh, here locally, they're, I'm not, because we're live, I'm not going to say the names, but there was a candidate, and uh, he had a consultant that was helping him, the consultant was, was the head of a mini packs here, he, his pack went out and supported his opponent, Last week, and sent out some mail with some false information, just attacking him, hoping that it would sway people not to go with the guy that he was consulting for. I'm like, are you kidding me? You doing the art festival today? So have you done enough polling to get any kind of sense yet? Or no, no, you know what? That I just started and I asked like three people and that guy came over like a little thing. Who'd you vote for for city? I know you're a city. I'm hearing this, that's this Frank guy. <laughs> uh, he'll be, he'll, 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 he's saying that he's going to do the job, so I'm going to give him the opportunity. I've seen what the, the current administration does, and <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm up for some change. So you're up for change with I'm Frank? Up for change. Yes. Oh, there's Mike Moran. I, you know, I actually like the Democrat Fred Akins. I don't know who you went with, but. Uh, Mike's a nice guy, but he, uh, I don't know, I haven't, like Fred's, it almost comes down to personalities, and Fred showed more interest in South, in Venice, mm -hmm. and uh, Northport, which a lot of the county commissioners don't. They forget all about down here. I'll tell you how I voted, if you want to know. Sure, well, let's, <laughs> how'd you vote there? See. <laughs> I voted for Trump. <laughs> There's Mike Moran. How you doing, man? Good hey, to how's it going, Mike? How are you? Good. Do I have to wait for your son? Yeah. Oh, there he is. Did the, are they not? Who'd you vote for with the city? Oh, you got your sticker. For the city? Yeah. <laughs> Do I really have to answer that question? <laughs> Do you want to say who you voted for for president before I log off? Not really. All right. All right, folks, that's it. I'm off to the art festival. Yeah, it's downtime now, right? I don't know if I can see it.